Hi everyone, it's Graham Norton here. I remember I was part of, I think, Childish Things 6, and it was a great night, a, such a fun night, and a very starry lineup of comics. I was the weak link in the whole thing. And uh, I'm so proud to think that Childish Things over the years has raised, I think, around about half a million pounds, which is an extraordinary achievement. And uh, I was there when they cut the first turf at Douglas House. The bill that day was more varied. It was me, a nun called Sister Frances, and then the, the, real, the real coup was they managed to get a horse called Douglas. <laughs> we later went on tour. It was a great success. Uh, listen, uh, good luck to uh, Douglas House and Childish Things, and uh, long may they continue. And it's a pleasure to play one of those gigs that you just look forward to doing. That's right, and we, we are just another couple of people who Kate Day has compromising pictures of. Just to how it goes, I guess. Uh, to be perfectly honest, I mainly come for the catering, because they're, they're usually quite good at these sorts of things. It's nice to help a good cause along the way, but I've just had coronation chicken with couscous, but the couscous had like bits of feta and roasted Mediterranean vegetables in, which that would be probably the best the best couscous, I think. So those would be my main reasons. It's nice to help and, and the couscous. Yeah. Because I was asked to and I said yes. As if it's a good cause and whatnot. It's nice to see all your mates really and that you've not seen since you were on the circuit you know so it's nice to see Jimmy and uh, Andy and Rob and all those Michael and, and all these people that you've not seen since you were in some you know room above a pub somewhere you know so to be in a lovely theatre um, you know full sold out but also only have to do you know 10 minutes um, or 15 minutes with your mates is um, it's almost like a night off Really, it's more social than anything. It was great to watch the video beforehand and actually just before you performed to understand what it was going towards and what it was going to do and how it was going to help. So that made it very, very worthwhile seeing that. Obviously, um, my biggest highlight, being able to stand up there on stage and just see all of these amazing people that have come to watch not just the people but give back to Helen House because that's that's what they're there for and also to have a giggle. You turn up and it just feels like a massive deal that you've turned up you know and uh, and it's weird because for you you're like well I just turned up and then to everybody else who are there they're like oh thank you for coming you know you think it's all right. <laughs> The laughter is so important. Keeping, keeping smiles, keeping laughter on everyone's faces, because sometimes if you don't laugh, you cry, and everyone needs to cry. I need to cry all the time, but laughter keeps it going, and that's what Childish Things is all about. My favourite memory of doing Childish Things was the year that Miranda Hart and James Corden were involved, and I was sort of allowed to get in the middle of the madness um, uh, and they were both fantastic. And congratulations for 10 years of shows, that's just amazing. I performed in year seven with James Corden doing Dirty Dancing. It didn't matter that it was a charity night, I basically just wanted a dirty dance with James Corden. It was a ruse. <laughs> Tell no one. It's a cliche but it always felt like such a big family and such a friendly one. And it was um, it was so lovely to be involved, and it was so lovely to be asked back. I'm really sorry I can't be with you tonight, but I hope you have a fabulous evening. Have what I call such fun, do you see? And congratulations for 10 years of shows, that's just amazing. We just want to thank you, the audience, for coming back year after year and supporting us and supporting Childish Things. Massive thank you for that. Obviously, Thank you hugely to the 89 acts who have taken part in Childish Things over the years. Without them and their generosity, really, Childish Things would never have existed. And what a decade it's been. Bye, have a lovely evening! <laughs>